Swag or drip? I got to go swag. The only drip I engage in on a daily basis is dripping the last two drops of urine on my khakis after I come out from the bathroom. Ew. Oh, what? So you wear jeans? It's the realest thing he's ever said. It's just something about it, man. There's a, it, it's hard to get the last couple of drops out. And then sometimes you feel like you got the last couple of drops out. And then you zip up. And before you know it, as soon as you drop your balls, it's like... We got a little dab on the fly. I've been known to give it a shake. I've been known to do the gooch press, but, but even still, you got to kind of, I mean, you got to do a little bit of both, I think, if you want to get the whole thing. It's like the, the bottom of a peanut butter jar, man. I feel like if there was a god, peanut butter jars would almost be shaped like, um, like Ciroc vodka bottles. Like they would be wide at the top and they would get narrow as you got to the bottom. So that you weren't trying to put like your whole wrist inside of the jar and then having to rotate it like you're doing arthroscopic surgery to try to get the last little bit of peanut butter like out of the, the circumference of the thing. They got to be triangular, man. I am triangular. I traveled a thousand kilometers to New York City to do this. I am rectangular. I feel it in my bones, I am rectangular I feel no hole, I am rectangular And you are a circle, I am rectangular I feel no hole You know what's crazy? When he sings, there's many things about it that doesn't make sense. But when he says, I am rectangular I have no hole, I am rectangular, and you are a circle. But a circle doesn't have a hole either, unless it's a donut or like a bagel or something. The only, a, a, a circle could be a hole, I suppose. Did you hear he got kidnapped? I didn't hear about that one. What do you think the Caesars meant when they said jerk it out? Uh, I don't listen to music designed to sell iPods, okay? Sorry. I only listen to music designed to get you to go out for uh, an overpriced fast casual dinner. Let's pretend we don't exist. Let's go to out back tonight. Let's go out back tonight. Yeah, yeah, I'm a real one. That's my favorite of Montreal song. I think that's a little bit crazy. Me personally, it would probably be something off of um, Hissing Fauna, Are You the Destroyer? I mean, there's some bangers earlier. You know, Requiem for OMM2. I, when, when it gets way back and it's very like musical theater-esque, there's still a couple of, you know, Coca Laco, Asleep in the Poppies tracks that I can get down with. But I'm, I'm more of a Sunlandic Twins, Hissing Fauna, Are You Destroy the Destroyer type of Montreal era. What's the one where he goes like, uh, Only leaving once a day to get some groceries. That's Heimdall's Gate like a Promethean curse. Me, when I'm in a naming my songs a lot of words competition and my opponent is the guy from, of Montreal, who I want to say is named Kevin Shields, but I know he's not Kevin Shields because Kevin Shields is the guy from My Bloody Valentine. <gasps> of Montreal guy name. Kevin Barnes! Kevin Barnes! Kevin Barnes. My mistake. See, that one stings. I should have known that one. It is kind of crazy that the dude who is of Montreal is named Kevin Barnes. Never once have I listened to an Of Montreal song and been like, yeah, this sounds like it was made by a Kevin. Oh, baby, I hear the blues are calling. Toss salads and scrambled eggs. That's a Kevin song. Oh, baby, I seem a bit confused, but then maybe I got you pegged. Ha! But I don't know what to do with those toss salads and scrambled eggs. Grinch-ass voice. They're coming again. Thank you. Good night. Good risings to you as well. Okay, let's get started. We're going to do the dulls. Here's what we're going to do today. First hour, we're going to go fast dulls. We are going to play 
Solium Infernum after that. It is a board game inspired multiplayer grand strategy game. I will be playing through what I assume will be the tutorial and then perhaps introducing my friends to it at a later date if it seems like we can all handle it. And then at one, we'll be doing Jackbox. I, I hope we're going to do it for two hours. We got some people for two hours. We got some people for one hour. Jackbox! Until someone invents a Jackie or Box. Benny Safdie voice. Bandle. 1965, 250 million views. Ooh. <laughs> Malik takes the package from the American man. Malik takes the package to the free trade zone. He's quick, ordering a subway combo. No chips, give me the macadamia. Okay, you know the talking heads? This is, obviously that song's from 1982, so it can't be this. I don't know what this is yet. Give me a, give me a little help. Ooh. <laughs> okay, all right. Am I crazy to think that this could be like some Robert Marley? And I'm not talking about Ebenezer. Oh, man. <laughs> That's a lot of Bob Marley songs. <laughs> This is One Love by Bob Marley. Oh, he's cracked. I mean, listen, I'm not sure if everybody's like this, but if I hear some reggae type beats, first thing I think of, Bob Marley. I'm just kind of cracked like that. They don't build them like me anymore. <clears throat> you remember when we were talking about reggae and I looked up the reggae charts for the Billboard Hot 200 and Bob Marley's legend has been the number one selling reggae album every week? since like 1978. Dude has a, a stranglehold on the genre still. <laughs> the National Football Association. This Ravens running back made history as the fifth player to ever rush for over 2,000 yards in a single season. Who is Jamal Lewis? Thank you, NFL 2K4. Thank you, NFL 2K4. Now listen, he's no Priest Holmes, okay? He's no Larry Johnson. He's no LaDainian Tomlinson. But he was, he was, I mean, when you got the Ravens defense with Ray Lewis and Ed Reed holding it down, the offense can run wild. A 2X consensus All-American, Kofi Coburn averaged over 17 points and nine rebounds playing for a Midwestern school known as Indiana University. I do not know college basketball. This Western Conference MLS team won the MLS Cup in 2022 and has finished with the best regular season record twice. LAFC, not the Galaxy. The man is crazy. <laughs> Two out of three on sports? This American gangster gained notoriety for Chicago, who is uh, Al Pacino, a.k.a. D.L. Guiga's uh, great uncle. What? I typed Al Pacino instead of Al Capone, didn't I? And I said Al Pacino instead of Al Capone. <laughs> All right, that's Simon Cowell's face. I, I promise I am not, there's nothing untowards here. The first thought I had was that this is Kim Kardashian. I'm just trying to, it's hard to just remove his face, I got, I got some chapstick here. I'm going to put it over his face. Just making sure you can't see what brand I use. I got to go. I don't think it's Kim Kardashian, but I don't have a better guess. Stings. Mashup. I got to see the mashup here. It is Olivia Munn. I never would have gotten it, but fair enough. Now, if you had Olivia Munn's face on Simon Cowell's head, I would get that any day of the week. But that, that's a tough pull. Connections has gone viral. Have you seen this? 
people posted yesterday, not mine, but like independently, they posted uh, yesterday's connections, the one that was like true, vreen, mellow, and grew or whatever. And they were like, the New York Times is trying to give us all schizophrenia. The, it, there were colors with the letter, the first letter changed. We just got lucky because we had solved the other three. So the rest just, you know, the rest just fit together. Forest, olive, mint. These are all kinds of green. A fleet, a caravan, a train, and a parade. Um, what are convoys with multiple vehicles? A procession. Mm, a procession. Hmm. Let me think about this. Let me think about this. Hedgehog. That's all right. You can remind me tomorrow on that bad boy. I'll pay you Tuesday for a reset today, I will. Things with needles. Things with spines. A book, a skeleton, a cactus, and a hedgehog. Things with, with, with spines. Things with spines. He's insane. Noble, democratic, sad, erotic. What is my Bernie Sanders fan fiction? What is... I have no idea, to be honest with you. What blue? Oh, blue! Possible definitions for blue. Am I wrong to take a slight bit of issue with this? I don't feel like blue means democratic. I feel like it could be democrat. Democratic is a... Uh, that I, I associate it as a different word. Like the Democratic Party. I guess Demo, Democrat is short for Democratic. <laughs> they cut two letters off it. It's not blue in the UK. All right, well, when I play Only Connect and I'm like, you know, what the hell are the bishop's knees? And then everyone in England is like, oh, that's what we call like uh, little bits of fish and chips that are left in the fryer after you take the fish fillet out. People are, whenever I'm like, that's not fair. People are like, well, just move to Birmingham for a couple of years and figure it out, bro. You mean scraps? Bro doesn't know about the bishop's knees. <laughs> oh, man. Did you see the... <laughs> The tweet that Sam Mendez is making four separate movies about each of the Beatles and that they're going to interlock with one another, and uh, which makes sense considering they were in a band together. And then like the, the follow-up tweet that was like, Paul's movie is like, oh, the band sees me as domineering because I'm trying to be a leader. John, oh, I'm transitioning out of being an artist to becoming a peace activist. George Harrison, the other band members, don't take me seriously and don't respect my artistic contributions. And then Ringo's movie is just like the start of Austin Powers, where he's running away from the ladies and like dancing in the, <laughs> in the frame and stuff like that. Anyway, okay, it's 1998. It's pre-Shrek by a little bit. It's a DreamWorks film starring Tom Hanks. From 1998? It's Saving Private Ryan? How much money did this make? 30 million opening weekend July? July is a big movie month, bro. Is it possible this is Saving Private Ryan from DreamWorks? It is. DreamWorks made Saving Private Ryan, huh? Okay. That took a little, a little bit of nuts on the table for me to even feel comfortable pumping that in there. But I know Steven Spielberg was involved with, with DreamWorks, right? Before they just started making Minions movies? Yes, it was his studio. Sony Pictures, 47 milli. Second week, pretty standard drop-off. Starring Antonio Banderas. It's got to be the Mask of Zorro. Timeline lines up. Great movie. Honestly, not, I wouldn't call it underrated. Everybody knows that has seen it, knows it's good. I think people have forgotten that this movie is like actually great. And the sequel, we don't need to talk about it, but it's, it's maybe I wouldn't say underrated, but under, underseen in the modern era. A true 90s classic. And it cleared this Warner Brothers film by 300 grand. This one starring Mel Gibson from 1998. And this is past Braveheart. I'm going to say it might be the... I feel like The Patriot was like 2000. Yeah, okay. 
98, I would say possibly Ransom. Okay, we'll simmer on that one. It could be Lethal Weapon 4. I shouldn't have yeeted so many guesses. We could have tactically used some clues on that one. The faces you love, the action you expect. What an inspiring tagline. 20th Century Fox fell 9%, probably opened in more theaters this week. Starring Cameron Diaz. Oh, it's word of mouth. This is There's Something About Mary. People were like, you know that new Farrelly Brothers movie? It's great. How'd you get the beans above the frank? Bruce Willis, 149 million. This is Armageddon. There's no, it's no contest. One of the biggest movies of 98. 77th percentile today. We, we're, we're in our bag today, except geographically speaking. What a weekend at the box office. Something for everybody. Nowadays, it's like nine screens of whatever just came out, and then like one screen of a Studio Ghibli movie that came out in 1982. Al Pacino, if he was into Kill a Mockingbird. Atticus! See, that's true, but I, I have some issues with you saying that, okay? Because who is Al Pacino going to be into Kill a Mockingbird if he's not going to be Atticus Finch? Your, your dumbass is going to say Boo, Boo Radley. Oh, really? Because you only see that motherfucker for like three seconds at the end of the movie. Your dumbass probably doesn't even know it's Robert Duvall. Who? For the Godfather? Who? The old guy from Gone in 60 Seconds? He plays Scout. What's Scout's older brother's name again? Isn't he named like Seed or something like that? The world has changed so much in 100 years. Gem. <laughs> oh, man. Hi, my name is Atticus. These are my children, Gem and Scout. Gen Alpha asked names. No, if it was Gen Alpha, it would be, Hi, my name is Elizabeth. These are my four daughters, Olivia, 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 and Olivia. No disrespect. I know some people are going to go, hey, because you're going to have a child named Olivia. I'm not even saying it's a bad name. I'm just saying it, it is, it's in the zeitgeist right now. Now, Hacksaw Ridge to Alexander Hamilton. This has Lin-Manuel Miranda, who's uh, in... Moana, he's in In the Heights, I'm assuming. Also, he casts all of the actors from Hamilton in every movie that he has an executive producer credit on. I pers I'm just going to try something. This is a little perspective. I know Hacksaw Ridge has Andrew Garfield, who is in Tick, Tick, Boom, which is a piece of musical theater that has me thinking there might be a connection here. But I'll admit this is a little, uh, it's a little presumptuous, and there might be a Richard Kynes in that, huh? I just thought, oh, there, Christopher Jackson, who's in motherfucking Hamilton. He's actually done it. He's, he found a, a strategic thread instead of just brute forcing it for once. Shortest possible two in 19 seconds. You will never see this ever again. Clip it. <laughs> I've never gotten the canonical short path. That is a slash moment. To be honest, brother, this shit looks like it's straight out of Kali and the... <laughs> or it's... Or it's not... I don't think it's Ori in the Blind Forest. But it's the... Oh, never mind. I, don't, I have no idea what this is. Skip me. This is, it looks like, like Catherine. Mobile PS4 Switch and PC. The world ends with you. Oh, no, no, no. This is uh, Sayonara Wild Hearts. That's a great game, bro. That's a great game. I know Sayonara Wild Hearts. It's the, it's the rhythm game. I did uh, Northern Lion Tries. How do you know the world ends with you? <clears throat> there was a period of about eight years where um, every once in a while, maybe like once a month, an Amazon package would get dropped off at our house and I would open it and see uh, a Japanese video game that I had never heard of before in my life. There are so many JRPGs that I'm at least familiar with the name of the saga and had never heard of before in my entire life. 
Were you a big Prozac guy going on, growing up? How'd you know? I don't want to go to work. My libido's gone berserk. I don't want nothing to eat. Walking up and down your street. And only two weeks ago, he said he'd never leave me. Bop, bop, bop. Here I am alone. That's strange disease. A lot of people prefer sucks to be true. I'm a strange disease guy or maybe like an Umbala Charest sort of guy. This is Mega Man 6. Mega Man 3. I don't think I remember Heart Lady from Mega Man 3. This is Bomberman. Super Bomberman 2. It is Super Bomberman 2. He's really just like kind of exploding them with reckless abandon, huh? I'm not trying to... I know like a lot of people have positive memories of Bomberman. I don't know if there's a more popular game franchise that I just could not give like less of a shit about. There's a lot of games like that where they're kind of like sacred cows. I'm not trying to tear them down or anything like that. I swear, you can like whatever you like. But like, I don't give a shit about Bomberman or Sonic the Hedgehog or fucking Super Monkey Ball or like Joe and Mac and stuff like that. It's all for, it's for you, guy. by all means. Enjoy yourself, but just, I, it's just not for me. Like, people got really, really strong opinions about Sonic the Hedgehog, man. What about Donkey Kong? I was kind of like wondering, like Kate was like, hey, you know, this game comes out next week. And then she showed me like a trailer for Mario and Don Mario versus Donkey Kong. And I was like, what the hell are they doing, man? Nobody wants this. I know I'm not trying to get in trouble, but like, I'm not like, I get it. Not every game. You can't just be making like another Legend of Zelda like every six months or something like that. But really? Rip sponsored stream? There's no shot I will get sponsored to play a Nintendo game to begin with. Because I swear. And I don't wear a Waluigi cap in my YouTube avatar. I mean, things can change, but... Hungary. A geographical name meaning landlocked country... Try to trip me up on the easy words, bro. Scrounge. A verb meaning steal. Scalp. A She's really heavy on the enunciations today. She's going Dakota Johnson mode. You're going to love it. In fact, I think you're going to see it twice. Her web unites us all. Harvest. A noun meaning the... Okay. Easy mode. Iambic. A noun mean... A noun meaning when you talk like Shakespeare in 11th grade science class. Mortgage. A noun meaning a... Stimuli. A noun meaning something that... I, th I thought for a second I thought it was two eyes. Okay, so I, I just had to go with my gut on that one. Nanotechnology. <laughs> A noun meaning the manipulation Sun. of materials on an atomic or molecular scale. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, I, I was doing that this morning. Maritime. A adjective meaning of relating to or board. Could this be the one? Nuts on the table? Rastafarian. A noun meaning an adherent of rust. Yes. Bibimbap. A noun oh, meaning a Korean dish of rice. Nice try. <laughs> I can spell it backwards, forwards in English and in Hangul. Bibliopagist. A noun meaning the art of binding books, derived from Greek words bibli. Bibliopagist. One who binds books. Bibliopagist. Acites. A noun meaning. When your when your belly's full of goo. Oologist. A noun meaning a person specializing in oology. Oologist. A noun meaning a person. Sp okay. What is oology? How close were we? Bibliopagist. Aww. <laughs> Eggs! It makes sense. Bro, what's the study? You got a shell, you got the white, you got the yolk. Boom, done. Here's your PhD. Oh, I know, you forgot about the albumin. You forgot about the... Nobody gives a shit about the albumin, bro. Nobody cares about the albumin, brother. That's part of the egg white. See, this is why I don't have my PhD in oology. 17 O's. This is from, well, you're getting me in trouble here. <laughs> it's a Cuban sandwich. I assume Cuba would be a good guess here. I also assume that perhaps 
it, it reached the peak of its popularity in Miami, if I had to guess, but I, I got to go with Cuba on this one right out of the gates. Okay, my, the United States would have been fine. You know they love that in Ketchikan, Alaska. Next round. This is from the nation of Germany. This is L.A. Galbi with cream sauce potatoes. It's north of Germany. This is from Sweden. This is from Denmark. Stegflesk, traditional Danish dish consisting of crispy fried pork belly. That's fine. Why, why does every single Danish dish say, like, it represents a connection to the country's agricultural heritage? Like, is this from the Chamber of Commerce of Denmark? Like, it doesn't matter if it's, if it's bread soup or, like, potatoes and meat. It's like, it has a connection to the... Re of course, it, everything has a connection with the region's history, motherfucker. It came for free with your context of being alive. Chat GPT ass answer. I didn't think Stegflesk fell out of a coconut tree. Don't be ridiculous, man. To me, this looks like miyokguk from Korea. It looks like a seaweed soup from South Korea. I've got to follow my heart. Wow, it's not even close. All right. I don't know what the olives are. <laughs> Maybe they're olives. Six, 7,000 kilometers away. It looks so much like miyokguk, man. Maybe these are olives, and this is from the Levant. This could be a soup that you encounter in North Macedonia. To the, to the east of that, to the east of North Macedonia. Georgia, the nation of Georgia. Oh, chakapuli, a traditional Georgian dish. Let me guess. It continues to be a beloved dish that represents the rich culinary traditions of Georgia. <laughs> no way, bro. Me, when they put a McDouble on here. But it's true. Anytime I eat like a McDonald's hamburger, I, I, do, I feel a connection with mid-century Americans. I'm sorry. I feel like Tom Landry could have been driving a Buick convertible up to McDonald's and eating the same thing now that I'm eating 74 years later, okay? We're all on the same divine thread, bro. We're just further along or further back. Dude, 40 pack of marble cheese strings from the Costco frozen food section. Oh, man. Just a nice thing to have in the fridge. Hey, I'm a little hungry. Maybe I could just have a cheese string real quick. Maybe I could have two cheese strings real quick. Do you tear them apart or do you just bite them like a monster? I bite them like a monster. No inner child. You guys have to decide whether you're going to be hypocrites or you're going to have a clear ethical through line. Because uh, whenever I don't eat Dunkaroos, people are like, you're old and boring. Whenever I demonstrate some whimsy, people are like, there must be a gas leak in there. Make up your mind, you disingenuous motherfuckers. Whenever I go, what? People are like, what, what happened? He used to be a streamer with erudite diction. Now he's screeching like a, an amnesia let's player. No, 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 no. Wrong, 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 wrong. Hello to the gamers. I am super excited today. We are checking out Solium Infernum. It is not a sponsored segment, despite me saying, wake up, honey, new board game inspired online asynchronous grand strategy game that you can play with your friends just dropped. Um, I, I just am a sucker for digital board games turned into the incorporeal ones and zeros realm. Remember when I played... Um, the Banished Vault, the space game where you got to manage, you take your spaceship, boo, one node forwards, and then you're like, oh, I forgot the lithium. I got to, boo, boo, boo. We had a great time. I enjoyed it immensely. This is from the developers of Armello, a game that we played on the NLSS probably 20 times. Uh, so they, they got experience when it comes to making digital board games. Now, I have been pre-warned that it's a complicated game 
This is not sushi go. You don't, like it's not five minutes. You're going to figure out what's going on. But to the victor go the spoils, okay? The dark majesty has vanished and the throne lies empty. Revelation will teach you about the core concepts of Solium Infernum. Take your first stumbling steps towards eternal rule over the wicked and the damned and claim the throne. Welcome to hell. I believe that your goal in this game is to become the leader of hell. There's a few ways you can do it. You can kill all the other people vying to become the leader of hell. You can reach a, a high score, which then the council of hell elders will deign you the next leader of hell. Uh, and maybe there's some uh, other mechanics you can interact with as you play as well. Of That's me. Maybe, never mind. I've already gotten something wrong. That's my tutorial giver. Belial! Isaac mentioned! My lord Astaroth, you have awakened that are already brimming with that hallmark rage-filled vigor. The Conclave is eager to see what fresh levels of depravity you will visit upon us in your campaign for the throne. It has been some time since you left the comfort of your pain chambers. Take a moment to remind yourself of the view. Hell stretches away to eternity, a game board with no edges wrapping infinitely back upon itself. They're absolutely right. Despite our intentions to sculpt this land, hell continues to be a disorienting bound of endless horizons. Me, when I mow the lawn on Sunday, and then two weeks later I gotta mow the lawn again? Select your stronghold using your left mouse button. Find and select Pandemonium. Hell's capital city, the seat of all power, prized by every archfiend, crucial to winning by either election or force. Remember that you cannot enter a canton owned by another archfiend without a hostile or servile diplomatic status. During a vendetta, which is a war, okay, or submitting to vassalage. I see the grand strategy elements. I see the DNA. After all that excitement, I see you've only used one of your two orders. For lack of another legion to command, perhaps you should direct your minions to source more tribute. A seek tribute action brings you a choice of tribute currency when the new turn begins. Economics makes for boring conversation, but what good is declaring war if you can't pay for it? Okay, I will seek tribute. Use the seek tribute command. I will do so. First, I'm going to click on my strong suit. I mean my stronghold. Seek tribute. <laughs> the older I get, the harder it becomes for me to find the buttons. I'm sorry. I'm just coming by it honestly. <laughs> Even sometimes I'll see a mobile game and I'll be like, how do you play this? And then they'll have like a digitized finger on the screen that is like swiping up. And I'm like, oh, and then you guys see your finger is the sword and you cut the fruit with it. I get it. Let us quickly talk of conquest so you can watch the Dragon Knight about to do his work. Let us look more closely at your personal legion, the blood of Astaroth. It's the leper from Darkest Dungeon. I can get down with that aesthetic. I'm, when it comes to, like, legions, I'm not an insect guy. I'm not a goblin guy. I can get down with like one really, really strong alien or something like that, but there's something about like the armor of a medieval crusader that I don't know, like deep in my DNA, maybe I've got like a Birmingham peasant inside of me who's like, yeah, a helmet with a little slit for the eyes and a 45 kilogram sword. Let's go. I think I, I think I would have made a great member of the retinue back in the day. I think I would not have caused any problems whatsoever for my liege. And I think that that is detestable. I don't think that that's a personality uh, quirk that I would consider positive. If anything, I consider it a, li a little sniveling. But either way, your eye would be pierced by an, pierced by an arrow. Yes, probably true. If I mean, if we're Stanford Bridge posting, I'm more of a Didier Drogba type. I've always seen myself as kind of like a, a, a striker who could win the Ballon d'Or. But number two, yeah, guy who gets his eye pierced by an arrow from Harold Hardrada. Absolutely. And with that, I'm confident you have enough knowledge to complete the trial of the throne without embarrassing both of us. The measure by which the Conclave will choose the winner is prestige. Every order must serve your goal of surviving with the most prestige. Anything else is secondary. The Prince of Lies leaves your innermost sanctum. Okay, you may pursue the race for the throne to its conclusion. I'm re I think I know everything. <laughs> of course. 
So my vendetta has, has been concluded, which means I should not be able to go to war with you anymore. Um, I'm the new favorite of the conclave. Incite rebellions. A conclave has been called to vote on this issue. I have a voting power of one. So the successful candidate will lose control of a number of places of power equal to their rank. Does anybody here even control a place of power? Whatever, I'm going to vote for the guy who's already golden. It's that easy. Bro, I went to the conclave. Everybody knows your name. They love you, bro. They love you. Your lips were on... Your, your name was on the Archfiend's lips. They couldn't stop talking about you, bro. Incite rebellions. What? As... I... I they're going to make me lose places of power? Just because I'm... I'm... Balling out of control? They hate to see you winning. I did nothing wrong and they edicted me. Nice. So nice. fucking stacked. Oh, That's why I jokingly bro. said we should invite Hello. Hafu so we can all get second place. I no, should we should invite Hafu. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well. Like, actually, dude. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm sure gold, she'd be down. Man. She would be she, yeah. She's going to destroy all. Yeah, no, 100%. It's just, it's just, <laughs> okay, that's it's just, just we don't know where first place is going to end up. Bro, it's a fucking stacked lobby today. Eight it people. Is, Look at this shit. We're so back. The, uh, there, there was too many people, and we have to kick someone, and I think we, before you joined, we picked you. Yeah, so. sorry, yeah, you buddy. gotta go. Oh, <laughs> the arrival, I mean, it's only fair. Hey, guys, unrelated, how does the voucher, or the, the, the onk, about, not the onk, the minus one anti minus onk. one hand per round yeah. thing work? It, so, so you just go back around, essentially. You so go back like around, the, so you get to play more. Yeah. yeah. And I do want to do an anti-11, and anti-11 is just a fucking stupid uh -huh. asshole. Too much. Yeah, yeah, no, that's a good time to do it. Yeah, it's a nightmare. Yeah, yeah. On a side note, I got a bone oh. to pick with your with your 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 favorite place on earth. Oh, uh, like Costco. What happened at oh, Costco? My, no, my... Yes, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with Costco? Is Costco okay? We we fucking you know, we 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 ordered uh we we like bought tires right. Okay. Yeah. Ordered them. Made an appointment for Wednesday night at six p.m. We drive into the tire, you know, place. We park, walk in. This the system sucks, but w w whatever. Walk into the store, go back to the tire place to give him my keys. He's like, "Oh, what's your name?" I'm like, "You know, blah blah blah, Corey." And then he's like, "Oh, oh yeah, we don't have your tires yet." He's like, "Oh yeah, if you look here, look, I even highlighted your number so that I could call you to tell you." <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, look, That's yeah, I even I even highlight. He he pointed that out three <laughs> different times. Uh, I, I I've never bit my tongue so hard in my life. I was like, oh my god. And then you know, the next day, the fucking power company tells me the power's gonna go off. They don't turn off the power. Maybe okay, you man. should m move out of the city. I'm. It I'm seems cursed. Taking it all down. That is hilarious. That he the had game that saves when deck. you. Go to the yeah, he pointed at the highlighter. Yes. 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 Okay. It's like this yeah. is a this is the Seinfeld moment of like, I made a reserve. I, I reserved a car. You should get you him like a car, free uh, year of executive membership. As far as I'm concerned, right? They should give yeah, me something. Yeah. They didn't even offer anything. <laughs> I was like, this sucks. They should give you a car. The thing is, when you go to the customer service desk, all negotiations are denominated in hot dog combos. <laughs> so, I mean, you might, I, me personally, I would start the bidding at like a hundred. That's, that's only $150 there. It is also 150 mug root beers, which might be a little overkill. Guys, now that you've told me that there's a capacitive mute button on my mic, I'm like a menace to society. <laughs> you're welcome. Yeah, you're just farting. I am! You know how good it feels to, to hit the mute and then drop like an insanely loud <laughs> fart? <laughs> and nobody knows? Oh, I know, buddy. Yeah, you oh, forgot man. to mute that one time. Hold on, let's, now, let's try. No. Oh, oh, right. Right. oh me, oh me. <laughs> Brian shot it. Yeah, paint your own pottery place. What are you painting? Mm. Ooh. So like straight up. Yeah. My number one was a a uh, mug. Mug was up there for me. I went mugless, but I understand. What? I think mug's gonna mug, be in the top mug, mug was my number one. Mugless. I don't even have to ask Corey sick right now, so I know he's painting the bowl. <laughs>
Hey. Hey. That was kind of like a crazy thing you just said. What the fuck? <laughs> with my with, wait, with my I'm not blowing my nose in the toilet. What are you talking was, about? The, the, the other too, end, man. The other. It end. was too clever, and that somehow made it less funny. I know it, it wasn't spontaneous. I thought of it like ten yeah. seconds before I said it. Yeah, okay. It was too it was rehearsed. Like a delay of processing for everybody yeah. for a moment afterward. Oh, the what classic. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with you guys. All of these are getting you killed. All of them. What? How are you? How are you? I will stab people. Hit them with a They'll think you're like a How's god a if you bring some matches out. Then. Anything that's weird to them, they're just gonna kill you. It's just I'm looking at this. Like, what it's can just I kill a people white with? Stick. You're just a bunch of meat to them. How you? Like, you gotta convince them that you're cool, but also that you're not too cool. Because if you like I've show them a flashlight and they're like, "Oh, that's cool," but now it's mine, and they just kill you and take your flashlight. No, nah, dude. Know? Like no. people back then must have at least been like, "Oh, you're another human. Everything here is trying to kill us. Let's be pals." Bro, they would be like uh... four seven and eighty three pounds. Like if they if they start rushing me, it's over. They'd also be like, "What's this giant white guy? What is the, the they, fuck is this like, thing? I'm gonna kill it." Their body fat percentage is like point four. <laughs> they're always I walking. They're lifting. They are freaking Mark from Primitive uh, Fitness. Just like I always be moving and lifting heavy. Did five of them climb first. on your back? Please let us go first. They're down. Like no, shop. No, no. I pick Shopee no. as my second one because you bro, you what? Look at the cave paintings <laughs> <Sharp, laughs> and you go look. I can do it too. You can do that with the cave paint they already have. <laughs> yeah, but you do it better with the Shopee, dude. It's I mean, MP3 player. They can arguably know. Uh, it's like I, do you do it better because their cave dude. paintings are still around 10,000 years later? I'm not listening to this. this I'm not so listening to this. That is I think this is. Actually bro, this is so right. Okay. Obviously, no, you're not yeah, taking yeah, a Sharpie back. Are you crazy? I'm so happy I was getting to pick. Good guy. It's got to be fucking MP3 player next. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, we're going bottom up, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah I'm down with yeah, that. Yeah, MP3 player. <laughs> they would kill you for this. They this is the only thing friend. that would absolutely kill you. Yeah. They would they not would, kill they, you for this. You guys are crazy. Well, oh, when, come, come, come. Let me stick this in your let me stick this thing in your ear real fast. They're I'll just leave it on the ground and tell well, them what to do with it. I'll back away. Play, play, CD play something and I would louder. The sunlight into their eyes and blind them. Bite there's, that shit. there's no communication, man. You're there's no the CD the from MP3. Of it. You, just, you get Could to be like, not. here's this, here's what it does. Here, you try. Pick yeah, candy. I was a flashlight of kitchen knives of mine, but do candy. Flashlight was my number one. Flashlight was number one for me. You think they're going to kill you over an MP3 play? You pull out a fucking. Movable <laughs> light source, bro. They're gonna fucking murder you instantly, dude. They're gonna no, yeah, them with it. I they the come after you. But you got the question was also befriend, though, is the thing. You were trying to impress them. Why do you guys think that the, candy, the cave people are so violent, bro? Like, yeah, that's bro, what have you been around, around lately? They, they might be chilling. Listen, I think flashlight's next. I do think flashlight. I think flashlight. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. I think now everyone thinks flashlight. I think multi tool. I think multi tool. Multi tool is more uh, practical. Flashlight helps them see at night. I like it's flashlight. I cannot you guys are insane. You flashlight. You're insane. What? <laughs> this you is like one or two mind. easy. This you guys is are easily your mind. one or two. What it's going to run like out of battery. You, you can't kill them man. with a flashlight. They're Why so do you have to kill them? them? You versus a fucking caveman. You're winning with a knife anyway. No shot. It's got. It's going to be. throw it. Yeah, you're they're not gonna care about a flashlight, and then they're gonna snap your neck in two. How many cavemen have been to an axe throwing event? <laughs> is it multi tool, guys? I think it is. No, right? a hammer, hammer. No, yeah, no. Multi -tool. what? Yeah, the, what? You could just it's use a rock. It's multi -tool. Yeah, it's yeah, a no, no multi tool is way more right. valuable. It's got multiple Ryan, functions. I, 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 agree, I agree with you. Chat's not thinking with their damn head. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We gotta go with the multi tool. We gotta go with the dumbass answer. Clearly. Oh my god. You guys are. Bro, it's multi tool. I'm pissed, dude. I'm pissed. It's hammer. It's not multi tool. It's probably hammer. It's not hammer. Hammer is the most relatable thing. You guys are one of my numbers. We're talking about relatable. This is the one object that'd be like, oh. I do think hammer's next. Bang, bang, bang. Rock, I also man. think hammer is next. Yeah, Matches God. is gonna be like number one. You can't even use what a hammer to do, do anything. You, we don't have nails. You can yeah, you, okay, you, like, you, you have a club. What if it's a sledgehammer? A hammer is effectively a rock at the end of a stick. That yeah, is just, it's, it's, that's crazy. That's well, it's not relatable, bro. It's a really, it's a really hard. I do think it is next, though. I think it's next. I think it's next, yeah. Well, I'm picking, so... Isn't this shit like 10,000 years ago? Didn't they have, like, like sledges and stuff I like that back then? I like... like, tools, man. <laughs> like we're in poly... 
Okay, That's fair cool. enough. So dumb. Go. I'm actually so mad. This are these, is so stupid. The cavemen are going to be like, okay, bro. Of these was the right thanks answer. thanks for the hammer, bro. We, we, we appreciate it. Chat wasn't picking the right answers, so we what went is the other a, way. What is a caveman going to do with a multi-tool now now over a hammer? Now it's multi-tool. What are yeah. they using I'm pliers for? I'm just pissed off because when you, you're going to bring or... back a hammer... And they're gonna be like, oh cool, a hammer. We'll throw it over here on our pile of hammers. Like they already have that shit, man. No, it's durable and they could forge they don't many have knives. They don't, they have metal. The, they they don't know see. the difference. They just think it's a really hard rock. They could forge many knives. <laughs> Why does he keep saying it like a D&D &D DM? I, don't know. I am a D&D &D DM now. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, right. matches. They already, have, they already yeah. have fire. This, I hate this game. <laughs> they have fire. They don't have a way to instantly create fire at the flick of a wrist. Yeah, they do stick. I really guess that's fast. you. <laughs> You're just matches, trying to defend, man. Defend them. They don't care don't, if they I, run. I, I don't. I don't know why flashlight was so low. I'm still pissed about that. <laughs> yeah. Because uh, it can't help you defend against the cave people. It's not just defend. It was phrased <laughs> as defend against. It was phrased. You also have like like half of the day is, is Bro, light. Just deleting and one of the words from the prompt and fire, pretending so it was the like, prompt, man. It was. They could do shadow puppets. Like batteries awesome. die. Wait. What are you gonna do? Oh, uh, I didn't think, think about the batteries. Torches? Solar. You could give no, them a solar they had powered more torches one. Than we did. Solar powered. Oh. Maybe the cranks, I guess, but like oh, the crank ones, those suck. Light? They do suck. Hold on, hold on. Stay back, stay back. <laughs> <laughs> You're dead. You're dead already. You're already yeah. dead. Ooh. You guys ever take melatonin? Yes. Mm, no. Yeah, Corey, you can't buy it here. Yeah. It fucking I, I, goes crazy, dude. I can't take it because it gives me like in it. incredibly <laughs> vivid nightmares. Yeah. yeah. I, I get the same thing. That's I'm told you're supposed you. to take uh, micrograms of it. More it than a microgram, bro. It's too much. Micro? I've been taking milligrams, bro. <laughs> yeah, apparently that shit fucks you up. Kilograms? Oh my god. You can't buy it here. It's illegal. Well, really? It's illegal, but you can't buy it here. You can't buy it. Yeah, you need like a prescription exist. or something? I don't even know. You just like walk into a shopper's drug mart here, and they're like, "Here, have some." That's cr yeah. I know it's crazy. You you can get it on Amazon. You don't even have to sign for it or anything. It must be bad. If you yeah, I, I tried it, it once because I was having trouble sleeping, and then. Woke up the next day feeling incredibly tired and was like, that was crazy. <laughs> Never yeah. taking that again. I honestly just sleep well as hell. The oh, recommended yeah, dose is 0. 0.4 milligrams. But for you, Justin, your weed has already killed your dreams, probably. <laughs> oh, yeah, I ain't dreaming at all. It's great. <laughs> what are you most passionate about? Probably a giant hog. H A W G hog. <laughs> Fucking Costco, That's bro. <laughs> How did you that have H A W G? That's probably, probably in the same yeah, answer. Probably probably same. I submitted the entire alphabet in all alphabet? caps. Yeah. I'll tell you. Yeah, I wrote hog. <laughs> I'll tell you my word cloud once we're done with the rap. That is, that is, that is an insane right word cloud. I'm imagining word cloud? another hog answer. I, ga I gave you a keyboard. I love that I contributed the A to that <laughs> sentence. <laughs> What's a team building exercise you'd like us to implement? Grocery store jerkin gang, wrangle a giant hog with a lasso, yeehaw! Okay, I know who's on the right. Yeah, yeah. I think I know who's <laughs> <laughs> My word cloud was sweater within a 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 sweater. <laughs> Something about a hog and then the whole alphabet. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? That was my word. And I mean, somehow sweater hasn't come out. Of that, dude, that was I didn't. Brilliant. I didn't have anything to do with the sweater. <laughs> What's an underappreciated skill in today's culture? <laughs> Say roo 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 like furry, not horny though. I swear. Or today's <laughs> culture like tap iPad and eat meal. I just want to be up front. None of the words on the left were mine. <laughs> the right is uh, really good and snarky. That's really good. Yeah. Yeah. No! Really good. It's crazy good. They're both good. What's the best way to motivate you? You sucked my little freak, I love you. Beating my little puffer god in my dick. <laughs> See, now that's upsetting because I know that that comes from my contribution of my stuffed animal dog puffer that I made since I was a child. <laughs> and they ruined it. Oh, that's Who would do that? God damn it. Oh, no. Suck my little freak, I love you. Now I'm never gonna be able to oh see that without thinking of Chip's dick. Your manager asks you to donate a kidney to his sick nephew. How do you respond? 
I would donate a scoop of shit. <laughs> Or brother, I hate you. Gonna order DoorDash. <laughs> Damn, cold. <laughs> oh, it's so dumb, but it's so oh, funny. Wow, it's close. You see coworkers leave the same bathroom <laughs> stall together. How do you respond? Fucking gay. <laughs> I compliment coworkers and shout, "What's up?" Great, great. great. Oh, oh that's so good. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Apollo just won. <laughs> gay. Uh, I just my ass fucking gay. Then, yeah. Yeah. I got a prompt that was like, uh, what would you do if you had a talking dog? And I was like, put that motherfucker to work. Shit's expensive. <laughs> and then it was like, uh, what was an instance of you getting bullied on the schoolyard? And I was like, motherfucker came up and told me I was gay. <laughs> <laughs> I promise funny final first impressions. I deliver cum, cum, cock, dick, cum, ha, ha, tee, hee. I promise I'm gay. I deliver sex like a fine steed. Damn, this is like a this is the headline of a fucking grinder <laughs> profile, man. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> oh yeah, wow. Man. Yeah, that, dude, yeah. gay that gay is, is a superpower, bro. It is. Right? You, can't, you can't use that though. Uh, no, yeah, I voted for I thought Apollo did it. This is fucked up. <laughs> Have you seen his raps? I think he can do it. Uh, yeah, you've seen my raps. Uh, that's true, actually. I promise Jackbox, I deliver the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> I promise my friends a dick, I deliver perfect penis. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn. I respect the first one. It's just yeah, first show. one's solid. No, you don't. Frick that. Yeah. Oh, I thought that was yours, like literally. I was wondering oh, because I thought it was you. Yeah. No. Oh no, it's Ryan beating me. <laughs> oh, oh, that's bad. I guess who's not sticking around so for the real now, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I love the uh, time. Mouth against him, too. That was the best. I promise fucking, I deliver. Come on, man. I met, I promise I met Owen Wilson at a gay grocery. I deliver a one time slice of hard space. Oh, wow. Thank you for the delivery, God. Ryan. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. The one time I, I don't even think he realized space. the delivery, man. <laughs> it lost. What? I still lost. How did it lose? Because he met Owen Wilson at a gay grocery. That was a a gay terrible. grocery. Gay grocery is is just like music to my ears. It was really satisfying uh, sonically. Yeah. It's like when Eli in that classic rap battle video says you're like Rosie O'Donnell at a bisexual bridal shower. It's like oh, it makes no sense, but you're like, holy cow. That just sounds good. It gets yeah. you thinking, right? Mm -hmm. Wow, Corey. Good game, good game. Congratulations, Corey. Still, you're sick and you still got it, dude. We love our Corey, don't we? We love our Corey. That is oh, horrible. Wow. That is... You sound like a bug. Your life literally is as valuable as a summer ant. <laughs> <laughs> Am I wrong? I really liked how satisfied you were with that, though, when you said it. He, he sounds like a bug, bro. No, no, you're not wrong. <laughs> Damn. A gay grocery store is such a funny concept. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> I, I thought we were going for an hour, so I got like 30 minutes. Isn't that just Target? Oh, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Me getting dragged out of the gay grocery store by the same security guard. <laughs> again and again and again. Were they like carding you before you go in? No, uh, well, he, he's grabbing me by the collar, but like I'm sitting on the ground and he's like dragging me like ass backwards out the front doors. And my pockets are turned inside out. He fuck it. This guy's super gluing his hands to the floor of the gay grocery. He's always thinking about that gay grocery. <laughs> <laughs> so can I tell you I something? Why specifically Owen Wilson being in it is, is really tickling. Wow. When Corey said super gluing himself to the floor of the gay grocery, I was trying to think of what food you could super glue yourself to that would obviously be in the gay grocery but wouldn't come across as homophobic. And I was I was really digging. I got to beets. I was like beets maybe. 
Oh. Beats? What, what would you say? Beats is pretty inoffensive. I don't know. I only knew one of these is a trout. We all clicked rainbow, right? We all clicked. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. That would have been the perfect food in the in the gay grocery. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's no, it's crazy. <laughs> Fucking Dolly Varden is one. Really? I clicked it because yeah. no, yeah. no Jackbox no, yeah, exactly. person is making that up. Like I'm it's so mad. happening. Wow. wow. Oh, oh, yeah, Why is Corey man. so good at fish, man? He knows animals, <laughs> man. <laughs> a little solo slice, maybe? A little mm. Super lucky? With this pure birthday good. energy? Corey. Damn it. Yay! Yay! You got two. Well, it's crazy two you got two solos. Seven yeah, back thousand. Three solos. <laughs> three solos. Wow. Yeah. Wow. wow. Owen Wilson. Wow. 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 It's a gay grocery store. Here. Wow. wow. Ra Rainbow yeah. travel. Wow. 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 Goes so nice it's with my marinated so beets. Wow. Nice. <laughs> Why is this bald guy super glued to the floor? Why? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if only I could get like continuation points from Job Job, I would have won. I think I've got all of them. You guys are cooked. I don't know. Yeah, I'm fucked. Yeah, I'm so I, screwed. I've never heard of any of this shit, man. You've never heard of uh, Logger? There's only one I wasn't okay, sure of. I've heard of Logger. <laughs> Man, wow. he's gonna be real pissed off when he doesn't choose funk. Extra devices. special bitter ain't some real shit, right? I think it's real. I, I, I think it because is. I, yeah, it was yeah, one of those ones I don't uh, think they could make ESBs. up. Yeah. Oh, I thought oh, India Dark Air oh, was real. Oh, oh, real. Jesus Christ, man! I thought India Dark Air was real. Extra special bitter is real. I'm mad. Yeah. yeah. ESB. ESB. Have you ever seen a beer that has ESB? Because I drink ESB. Oi. Get me drunk. I thought, I thought, I thought India Dark Ale would be there too. I love local dunk. The devil made me do it. Oh, I don't know, bro. I know that one. Wow. I don't recognize a lot of these. I know that one. That's about it, dude. I got two of them. I got three of them. I think I got that. Them. Sounds like some shit they would do. Yeah, that's good enough. I think I got this cleared. I, I, I got both of those. was more confident than I thought. I think I think there are some that might be surprises. I got I this picked HRV cleared. even this though is easy. I think it's the fake. I, I think HRV is real. Yeah. HRV is real. There's only there's only yeah. there's only, yeah. like, HRV's real. There's only five. The clarity. Hey. I knew I knew. Hey. That's I another one that's like this can't be real. I didn't take clarity. I didn't take clarity. The hell is oh, a Honda Clarity? Like a skateboard? <laughs> soul? Oh, it's the Kia Soul. I forgot. Oh, yeah, yeah I also soul. thought that was Kia Soul. soul. Uh, Kia Soul, Volkswagen uh, Jetta, Toyota Camry, Pontiac Aztec. Oh, my God. <laughs> my ass dumb as hell, man. Listen, if you learn anything from this round about me, I drink and I drive, okay? <laughs> not the at the same time. Come on. I'm gonna take not, the two matches. Please don't take them. Genuinely, not in that you order. Can have them, man. I got three chances. How do you guys get so many points? <laughs> I cheat. <laughs> I got three chances. Three chances. Three chances. That's not gonna Yay! do it. Bad spin, bro. Bad spin. We gotta give it to Chibli. We gotta give it to Chibli. You can give it to me. Guys, I lost Rising Star. Can you give me pity points? Can you just give me everything? <laughs> you rainbow wheel? Yeah. What's going on? What happened? Wait, is it rainbow wheel? Yeah! We are! Yes! Oh. Rainbow Corey's on wow. it so much! No, dude! He can't do it! He can't oh, handle no, it! He's sick! <laughs> he's sick! He's sick! Oh, oh, no. oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm not even on it! I'm not on it! <laughs> oh no, no, no! No! no. Oh, He's still he going. Oh my god! Thank you! Stop smashing! Oh! He was living the life too much, man. I gotta respect. He went nuts on the table for no reason. He went nuts on the table. I'm spinning it for everybody. Yeah. Yeah, God. everybody, dude. Oh. Neither. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah. Dude, Malph and I weren't even on the fucking rainbow. I was. I had a slice. That was crazy. You were on it? I, yeah, it I had a slice. Me? It was, it was just, just Ghibli. That's really funny. Don't give him a skull. Don't give him a skull. Don't do it, man. 
Look at this. You should have sure. given him a damn skull. He's got 30,000 points. He's got more than like the bottom four combined. <laughs> you can win right now. Corey's ass winning. No, love no the shot, wheel. No shot. No shot. I love the wheel. No! That's all right. He knew He knew Trout, bro. I can't Corey's sweet. Go. Why was I not on the rainbow oh wheel? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. You gotta see one last time now. What are you buying? That was a dominant round. I swear to god if it's his rainbow trout. Wow! wow. Oh, okay. Okay. Homophobic <laughs> ass game? Okay. I've never no, seen a no. rainbow wheel be more anti-gay. Like, <laughs> and never playing this game again, right guys? Yeah, chilly. <laughs> Pretty fucked up, man. Oh, nice, man. No, they mean the super glue to get the super glue. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah oh no, you should always wash your hands when you uh, when you go that's to a public true. place. Yeah, that's true. Welcome to class. Welcome to class. I'm Professor Handsome. <laughs> I keep you after class and kidnap you for ransom. <laughs> Don't look now. I stole your trucker, but you'll always be your mom's oh, number one fucker. Oh. Yeah. That's setting the bar way too It high, rhymes. <laughs> Nice. There's a callback. The call There's Good violence. Callback. Thank you. I'm the one. With I'm the one with the golden booty. You ready, mm -hmm. you ready to taste my dirty booty? <laughs> <laughs> my brain's so big, my head's about to crack. Speaking of crack, I'm following yours up to your back. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yo. Even when he's sick, he's just so really gay. horny. It's gayer every time. <laughs> <laughs> it's so gay. Corey might beat me just off how gay it is. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's insane. <laughs> oh. It's not, it's just not even gay. It's unhinged. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, I cannot man, believe you lost. It's like a <laughs> sensual kind of thing. Following <laughs> it up to your back. Oh, you're only gonna make him be gayer. Yeah, it's, it's romantic, dude. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, God. My wallet's full like an overstuffed cow. Four pockets stuffed. I'm the CEO of Mr. Plow. Excuse me while I turn up the first gear of my plow. It's just a killdozer. Actually, you should fear me. Oh, you should have left it on fear when it rhymed. <laughs> Bro killed his own rhyme. I respect yeah. that, though. Oh, I didn't, he didn't even realize it. I dropped one single, now I'm rich as gates. Now I'm beating your ass at the gay grocery store. Too late. You better recognize I'm the ultimate torpedo. About to sink your sub, because I'm the Dom Lil Chico. <laughs> You gotta stop setting yourself up with such difficult rhymes, man. That's what makes it funny. Who can read the Who can read the the leaves, the tea leaves to just fucking decipher that? Oh man! Get the voting, buddy. Pick somebody. I'm sure it'll be closed, right? Like, man, Chili, you're super like super Simpsons pilled, huh? Never mind. Nice. Sixty-nine, and I won sixty-nine. This guy already know what I'm gonna do next round. You're over, dude. You're going up against Ryan, so it's a toss-up. I'm fast, so use rewind to see my spunk. Oh no! It's easy to find. Just check your bunk. Oh no! I'm so pumped for this great bite of eighty-seven. I'm sending you to the moon, Apollo eleven. What the fuck? Bite of eighty-seven. It's a noun famous event. Overheat sometimes. <laughs> I'm practically magic, like a regular fairy. My head's a different breed than yours. Harry. Oh, my whoa. words are like paint. I'm an artist like Dr. Dre. I only shop at the best Dude, type of grocery that. stores. The gay. I mean, just... Oh, that might be one of the most lopsided. That was crazy. Of all time. I want to cook them for using hyphenated wraps, but then I realize I use a hyphenated wrap. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck did you say? Something of eighty-seven? The, the bite of eighty-seven? Yeah, man. What the fuck is that? It's from Five Nights at Freddy's. Yeah. What are you doing yeah. to yourself? Eighty-seven, eleven, heaven. <clears throat>
Mid off incoming, dude. He's clearing his throat. I'm over. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this got mucus, man. Uh -huh. I'm lighting you up like it's Easter. Your dead body on the floor. I'm gonna eat you. Respect me now like you'd respect Chip Drinky. Alcohol in my mouth. You just got a binky. Oh. Oh. Second line. Second line. Get some Chip Drinkies in chat. Look at him go. Have you, ever Have you ever considered a career in shipping? As soon as you leave, all the chicks will be dripping. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna roast you like a gabagool. You'll start to bristle like a chart of stools. Oh no, Ryan. <laughs> oh no, Ryan. What? What are you talking about? Line was unhinged, man. <laughs> I thought Corey's going so gay that I would do straight rap. That does not work, man. <laughs> I thought I would do aggressively heterosexual raps. Yeah, Sopranos is fits the bill for that. <laughs> when, when you thought that, did it feel good? What? <laughs> it just doesn't make sense. That why do they get horny when he leaves? It's like because <laughs> he's he's scaring the hoes, bro. No, they me, bro. And you guys don't even know about that? I referenced the Bristol stool chart and he has IBS. I cooked him. I cooked him medically. <laughs> You're not fit to hold my pajamas. Don't bother me none. I left them at your mama's. I'm in the dictionary next to the word nice steak. Don't eat too much. You'll have no room for this cake. <laughs> I'm just gonna be honest, if you're wearing pajamas to fuck somebody's mom, that's kind of gay. That's hard to tell. Are you feeling okay? Cause you look a bit stinky. Drop a turd in your trousers after your mom and I got kinky. Your rhymes are about as deep as a plate. Sicko sipping soup out of it like a lobster bisque first date. <laughs> We did go mo we did go you guys back spent to the first half of each other's verses fucking your We mom. did. <laughs> we did. <laughs> you came crazy like, oh, that shit, we, we did the same thing. Mouth oh, wow. Wow. Holy. That was very yeah, I didn't good. think it was like I didn't think okay, it was that sick of the joke. Dude, that oh, I just the joke, bro. Dumb, 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 dumb. That doesn't seem like a, an objective measure by any means. I've assumed okay, yeah, a new uh, rap persona. Okay. In the industry, it's important to reinvent yourself with every so you, album. You tried straight, didn't work. Right. Yeah, I don't think I don't think gay's your thing. Right. So. That, that that's closed off. Chat uh, showed they were homophobic when they didn't vote for Corey last time. <laughs> <laughs> right back, I, I think you're gonna no, be I'm... able to you're gonna be able to guess. Is okay. he dad pilled? Okay. Is this gonna well, be dad you're up first, so. Oh no. I'm gonna out. get in trouble. Next I've used the word I already used. In, but like, just forget, please. I forgot. We're the, we're the main thing. Yeah, we go. I hear you talking. You sound like Walter White, uttering offenses and awfully alt right. <laughs> Your face is so ugly, you broke my vase, and you owe me a replacement. It was very expensive, you dick. <laughs> Walter White was not alt right. He hated the police, bro. He was all right. Okay, thank you. You haven't seen the show. I grew, up in no, I, I grew up in the streets. You were raised in the Sistine Chapel. Pennsylvanians like to eat something called Scrapple. Okay. What's wrong with you? Were you raised by crows? Dwight Schrute's brother was sure named Moe's. Okay, it's you're the cousin. random rapper. I see. It's uh, his cousin Moe's. You decided to do a bad job. You can't get it right. Wow. You don't like trivia rap? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm the trivia, I'm the trivia rapper, bro. Trivia rap. I don't, I should, uh, I don't think that's gonna be a good sell, man. Oh, yeah, TikTok, man. They you might lose TikTok. to didn't rhyme, man. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got the champ bonus, though. That's huge. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Sport I did it. What's a scrapple? Uh, it's like a plate full of garbage. 
Um, Scrapple's okay. Like Scrapple's that? Scrapple's great. I mean, oh. the rhymes were good, but Scrapple? I didn't learn anything. So yeah, what's Scrapple? Oh. There's gotta <laughs> be like Scrapple. Uh, Ryan, you should be games. good at this game. I know it's <laughs> bothering me. <laughs> if if I if I ran a, a, a the two people here who most vibe with rap are at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Something's wrong, man. <laughs> it's the game that's wrong. I was out hustling while you were fucking yourself. <laughs> Tried your best but couldn't achieve self sucking. This if you is think, what we're competing with. If you think you'll win, you're straight up sleepy. <laughs> Good night, Grandpa. Let me grab you your binky. <laughs> That's great. Chibli. Baby oh. rap. Baby rap every I'm time. I've never rap. said binky before. That was the <laughs> future, dude. Marriage is a lot like politicians. You can never really agree on anything. Oh, wow. man. It's just... It's, this guy qualify? hates his wife. <laughs> I'm gay. This game needs music. God created songs by creating the Beatles and a lot of other bugs too, folks. <laughs> No, that's, that's Wait, actually He's setting like up a follow-up statement. Is that a subtle, I think you should leave reference? Which comedian told a better joke. Does anyone feel like we're, we, we were operating on all cylinders and then one of the cylinders left? And all Bro, I'm cooking now. Yeah, welcome to joke boat. Also, it's no, like I'm, I got jokes great. coming off of jokes. May, you agree on lots of stuff uh, for marriage. Like, I agree on whatever my wife wants to eat for dinner every night. <laughs> right, what is that normally? <laughs> I don't want to answer that. <laughs> I have more drugs than Walter White. All back. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's, it's, it's unjokeable. No, I, I feel for him. That's unjokeable. I don't know how you're supposed to do that. My love life is like Gordon Ramsay. Yeah, Fucking raw. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's actually pretty good. That's a good one. Why did I go against his daddy? mouth, man? Oh. Wait, Dude, you're gonna win. You're that would like that would go joke. so well with my love life is like George W. Bush. <laughs> uh, that was a classic. Sorry, it's the W. What? Yeah, what? W. What? Wait. Oh, they could they could be a curious George. Oh, oh my oh, god! Oh, 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 I have never in my life seen a ratio that bad. I like my sex like I like my corn on the cob. <laughs> Bro, it doesn't make sense. Does anything else have a cob other than corn? I don't think so. If I don't what? click anything, does it skip my salad? Joke? <laughs> salad? Cob salad. That's two bees though, right? That's yeah, the guy. Thai Thai cob. I oh, yeah, this, this is so Have you bad. ever tried body pillowing? That's when you cover yourself in feathers and sell yourself at Target. Ah! <laughs> Literal interpretation. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Man, I'm in for this. this is the hardest vote I've <laughs> ever the had. Genuinely to make worst in what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> On the cob. Yeah. What? what do you mean? What is it <laughs> mean? <laughs> exactly. Exactly. You should have said creamed. <clears throat> Wait, oh, mine was creamed. good. What? Wait. Mine creamed, was so good! Creamed corn would have gone the distance, but you had to throw Yeah, I like my sex like I like my corn. Creamed. I like a sex. Let's I like my sex. <laughs> <laughs> Borad be like, no, 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 you can't, you can't say I like a sex. <laughs> I like a sex. <laughs> <laughs> no, now everyone's gonna know I like sex. Fuck. <laughs> he says he like a sex because he's only had it once. Hey, yo, bro, you were winning already. Relax. Call off the dogs. <laughs> Why he make us do the the end, man? Oh. <laughs> I thought I was cooking. Oh, they're gonna make me go first too. This would <laughs> this would hit like way harder fifth. <laughs> Marriage is a I lot like politicians. On the cob. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean you were right. He's yeah, so cooked, man. What do you He's think? Cooked. Does this joke beat the original? <laughs> 
I almost want to vote for it. I don't know why my mouse immediately went up to it. I don't. I I can't explain it. I feel like it's not that bad. I know, but I don't know why. It's making me mad. No! <laughs> it got close though. Oh, no. Nearly had the redemption arc. Sean Evan. God created songs by Badumps. <laughs> <laughs> it went along with the fucking <laughs> what the hell? Incredible. Holy. Wow. Holy wow. Shit. Oh. Oh, wow. Ryan, I had the Ryan Ryan it, man. that. If that didn't sync up, oh man. It synced up. Oh, he's mad. He's mad. <laughs> I have man, a, I had the drug human. one or uh, Bear's dentist joke, which was really good. I got one. I got oh, one. That was oh, uh, wow. it's just a oh, oh, yeah. it's tough to beat. My love life is like Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Fucking donkey. <laughs> oh, no. Ooh. It's the same I joke. It was it's bold, that's that's yeah, pretty good. That's tough, to, that's tough to choose between. Me shit. when I'm Shrek. <laughs> what? I've never seen it. Aren't they in love or something? You never seen it? No, I've no, seen it. I haven't seen it either. People happens. tell me I'm crazy, and I'm like, no, I'm just an adult. I'm just old. Uh, he said he saw it. Oh. Wow! Oh, wow! That's perfect. Honestly, it's perfect. Yeah. I like my sex like I like my corn. Don't. Creamed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Wow, these are my points. Hey, I'm good. Good. <laughs> said those are my points. These. He's gonna win. Hey, Joker. That's a really good joke, bro. Thank I don't know how so you came up dude. with that. What I would have said some shit like it on the cob. <laughs> bro, I <laughs> eat my creamed corn on the cob. <laughs> Because he's Wait, never had cream. Who's corn gonna win? Well, I cream corn is you go to, the, my you go to fucking Costco and you buy cobs in bulk so that you can fucking cob your favorite dishes regularly. I'll, I'll bring my own cob. What? A corn cob's dog's on, on a cob. Table. Steak on a cob. Yeah. What are you talking about? That's a cob. Cobs tangerines on, the on a cob. Cobs on the table. I'm top comedian. <laughs> cobs on the table. <laughs> hey! Oh. Wow. Ghibli. I want something, Ghibli. dude. Congrats, I Ghibli. Something. Congrats, Ghibli. Thank you. Thank you. Good, good job, gamers. Good job. Yeah, nice gaming. Well game, well yeah, game. We did our best. Well game. We tried. Till the end, you, yeah. You guys mind if I self promote real yes, quick? Yes, please. I have an album coming out. No, tonight. no, he doesn't mind. Oh, right. Yeah, I don't mind. So. I don't mind. As long as you do it on the cob. <laughs> I, I'm very excited about it. I've been working hard on it. It's called Patience. My rap name is B Supreme. It's coming out tonight on all streaming platforms. Please check it out. I think it's really good. Ooh, let's, go. let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hog. You should watch his video too. It's really good. Yeah, the music yeah, video rock. for Frederick. I, I I also think it's very very good. It's very and good. I, have an I also <laughs> think it's very very good. <laughs> yep. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. Brian check it out say on that. all streaming platforms. Yeah, coming out at midnight. At midnight Pacific time. Or like your time, I think. I think it just like syncs up with your Oh, life. okay. <laughs> so if you are in New Zealand, you can listen to it right now. Wait, I think, true, maybe, I yeah. Guess. Holy yeah, shit. Dude, yeah, oh, you should shit. check, Jib. What the heck? I should listen Chip can to stream it right ahead of time. Dude. No, I wouldn't do that. Dude. I'm going to VPN to Australia. <laughs> <laughs> All right, later. Fun, and that, later, uh, gamers, I gotta go. Into our next segment. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go. I gotta go pee so bad. I gotta go pee. I gotta go pee. I gotta go pee. I love you. Goodbye. Okay, I'm gonna send you over to Kate. Enjoy uh, the rest of your um, time, and I will see you on Monday for more streaming. See you then. Like Prozac, the Canadian cartoon band said, uh, "I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna sleep with myself tonight." No one else can harm me, uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. You guys ever listen to Prozac when they went through their weird abstinence era? Although I'm really quite fond of you, my best intentions never turn out right. I'm gonna sleep with your dad tonight, <laughs> uh-oh. Sorry, sorry.